Right, here we are at Burwell. Door still open. So we're going to have a wander in the church first. Because it might shut at four. And it's now 20 past three. <clears throat> Sarah and I did all this churchyard and brandy. But like I said, we did not take any notice. Um, of musk back then. And as far as I know, I don't think we ever found a brooks in here either. But there were masons and there are Isaacsons. But I'm not doing a detailed scan, I'm afraid. My energy levels are really going downhill. And of course I've forgotten the quick ways to everywhere. Um, just can't remember. But this is it. And of course I've also done, in the past, I've also done the castle nearby in quite a lot of detail. Um, I've got to remember there's quite a few mason graves here. And there's the tragic little stone of the children that died in the fire. That might be further over, over there, I think that is. There's somebody coming this way. We just have a quick scan today. There's a church. Yeah, I'll just go up to this the stone where in memory of the children that went to death about 70 odd I think and some grown ups here it is 78 people who were burnt to death in a barn at Burwell on the September the 8th 1727 this stone was cleaned and this inscription engraved September 1910 and some Isaacson family girls were burnt to death someone had locked the doors and they couldn't get out I just I'm just doing that because I don't visit here very often the stone does look a little bit older, like all of us. Everything's looking older. And I've got a feeling there was quite a lot of mason graves around here. Yeah, we are. There's one there. Like I said, I haven't really got into the masons yet. Henry Mason, up. he died January 18th. I can't know, I think it might be 31. And also Jabez, his son. That means James. He was only 21, that one. I mean, he could have died in the fire, couldn't he? Yeah, Zara and I ploughed through all these. It's all written down. It's on the audio tape recording that I did. Still got it. And basically, I, I share those audio pods to Mary's profiles on my family tree. And it's up to somebody to listen, if they want to listen to them. So there we go. St. Mary's, the Virgin, Burwell. Of course, we've got the inscriptions on the walls inside of our Isaacs and ancestors. Don't forget, it was the Isaacsons. Who married them to the Masons. 
the Isaacsons and the Stuckvilles. Oh look, cake. Mm. Right, let's go in. I remember that green effect right up there. I remember that green effect. Um, oh yeah, the frescoes on the wall. There is an inscription, but like I said, I have done all this before. Um, Um, these are ours. There's quite a few of ours here. These two here, Stephen Isaacson and Mary's wife and Diana, his daughter. More up the top, what an Isaacson gent, right up there. I don't know how you're supposed to light your candles, you know. These might be... i got a feeling these are battery operated. And none of them work. Because somebody's taking all the batteries out. Look. <laughs> none of them work. They've all gone flat. Look. I'll write my name in a minute. Yeah, some of it's coming back to me. And then we've got um, Sacred to the memory of John Isaacson Gent, late of this Landwaid Hall, who died October the 17th, 1831. I'll just do him again. He's one of us of Landwaid Hall, don't forget. They were gentry. They were landed gentry. They were landowners of significance in the community. <sighs> yeah, one day's not enough, is it? I mean, I did X in quite thoroughly. Um, This is just really a courtesy visit because it's been done so thoroughly in the past by me. It's just really coming back to say hi, I'm visiting again after five years. Well, actually, I don't know. Yeah, I might have come back five years ago, but my proper visit was actually ten years ago where I stayed at the campsite. Um, which has now disappeared. It's gone. All sorts of industrial development is on the beautiful site where I used to camp. It's all been... As soon as his mother died, he flogged it off. That's the sort of person he was. Was he? Yeah. I mean, if I didn't, wasn't so tired, I would do more, but my legs are... I've, I have done so much walking and climbing and travelling, I can hardly move. Oh, and I never sit down hardly at all. I never... 
um, have a rest. I eat on the move. And there's so much to do. But at least I've done excellent thoroughly. I've done excellent thoroughly. But I haven't got the energy to do the castle today. Um, to even climb up it, really. Um, this is just a courtesy visit today. A courtesy visit to Burwell. Which has been done, if you want to really know more about it. Um, there's a leaflet there. There's another one there. I probably got these, but I don't know if I have. They might not have had any when I had them last time. Turn off a minute.